another tutorial like promised and today's tutorial is um, gonna be inspired by Diana Agron's uh, I, that's how you pronounce her last name nylon cover um, and it just looks like this it's very very pretty it's a beautiful frosty look and um, I attempted to do it and I hope you all like it and as I was looking at my products Everything that I used like in this tutorial is all drugstore. The only things that are not drugstore would be like the blush and the highlighter and then like foundation and stuff which I didn't do in this video. Um, but I just wanted to show you the eyes. Hopefully the camera will um, zoom in or not zoom in but hopefully you'll be able to see that with the mascara and stuff. And that's just what that looks like. Yeah, it's a very, very simple look. Um, I changed some things around because we have different skin tones, obviously. And yeah, I hope you all enjoyed it. And please comment on this video. Tell me what you uh, like about it or even what you don't like about it. And yeah, I'll see y'all later. Bye. Okay, so I'm just going to be taking my Maybelline Eye Studio Master Drama Pencil in, I think it's Midnight Master, and it's just a retractable pencil. And I'm just going to be lining my... La my lash line with it and um, it's not going to be too thick but at the same time it's not going to be too thin and we're not going to wing it out just yet just bring it to the corner of okay, the eye okay so that's what that looks like and then I'm going to be taking another Maybelline um eyeliner and it's a gel liner it's the Maybelline eye studio gel liner in blackest black and I'm gonna be putting it just on top of that so you know if you use like two liners you put one on top of the other this is what I'm doing and then at the same time I'm gonna be going over what I did with the other liner okay so that is what that looks like and she doesn't wear anything on her bottom waterline, but she does have um, a liner um, on her bottom lash line. So that's what I'm going to be using, or that's what I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to be taking this Annabelle Eye Cult liner. It's just a pencil liner, and it's in black. And I'm just going to put it um, maybe three quarters of the way through. Okay, so that's what that looks like, and I'm going to be taking the Master Drama eyeliner again, and I'm just going to be connecting these two things. Not really creating a winged outline, it's just like, just closing it off like I did on my left eye. So I'm just going to be doing that on my right eye. I'm just going to meet everything in the middle and just, I guess, color it in. So that's what that looks like. And then the final part of the eye look is going to be mascara. And I'm taking this Maybelline Falsies Volume Express Mascara. And this is in Black is Black. And I am going to be putting three coats on both my top and bottom lashes. So I might just edit some of it out. Okay, so that's the eye look. It's pretty simple, you know. Um, it, I feel like the lashes, it's kind of like a spider lash effect. I'm not the biggest fan of that, but um, I, you know, it's not too bad, I guess. But she's probably wearing, like, uh, some, like, fake lashes. Not, like, a whole fake lash, but just, like, the small parts, like, the inserts. But, yeah, so that's what it looks like. And next is the cheeks. So she has on, like, something very, very neutral on her cheeks. Um, it's like, it's kind of like a peachy brown color. I guess kind of like a bronzer on her cheek. But um, I'm going to be doing something different. I'm going to actually take a pink blush. It's like a pinky purple. And this is my Tarte blush. And it's called Blushing Bride. And it just looks like that. And I'm going to be taking that on my cheek. I'm just going to be layering this 
maybe like put two to three layers just to give a dramatic effect because this is like a full coverage and like dramatic look for a photo shoot. Hopefully that's noticeable on camera. And because this is like a kind of like a silvery, um, it's a silvery kind of metallic look. It's, it's a frosty look. That's the word I'm looking for. It's kind of a frosty look. I'm going to be taking my Benefit High Beam and I'm going to be putting it on my cheekbones. Okay, so that is it for the face. Now for the lips, she has on, um, it's like a very, 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 very pale pink lip and it's a frosty color. Um, since obviously we have different skin tones, I'm going to be using something else. I'm going to be using two different lipsticks and they're both drugstore. Uh, one is the Revlon Super Lustrous Lipstick in Iced Mocha and the other one is the Rimmel Moisture Renew lipstick in Heather Shimmer. So what I'm going to do is take Heather Shimmer first and it's a pink color and just looks like that. I'm going to apply that to my lips. And then I'm going to be taking Iced Mocha which is like a nice brown and just looks like this and this is what's going to give a kind of like the nudie effect, <laughs> you know, and yeah. So just put that over it. So that is how it is. Um, it's a bit darker than I was going for, but I think it still looks good for my skin tone. And yeah, I hope that you all enjoyed it. And I'll put the picture up beside me. As you can see, I tried to do the hair, but you know. So this is what it looks like, you know. This is the look I was going for in the face. And yeah, I hope you all enjoyed it, and, I'll, and please comment, rate, and subscribe. If you want to try this out, please do. Just put it in uh, the video response area down below, and please comment, rate, and subscribe. I feel like I just said that, and have a nice day. I'll see y'all later in my next video. Bye.